All right, a staple exercise at BFP for people who can't do pull-ups or we just had them programmed in. This is uh, the ring row. So the ring row, set up on this as far as grabbing the rings. We want the rings to at least be shoulder width apart. And then when we grab them, we wanna make sure we walk our feet into an angle that is uh, challenging for that person doing the exercise. So it may be different for each person, but um, we gotta figure out where they want their feet. All right, so a couple things that gotta be standard on this. We need to see that flat body as we lower ourselves down and come back up. So right here, I'm just demonstrating a wide grip. So this is a wide pull. On this one, I am flipping my palms to a supinated grip. So this is a supinated row or supinated ring row. So if you notice, I'm staying very flat as I lower myself down, all right? And I'm controlling it. That's what we wanna see. So as I go through this, that these are some mistakes. So notice I'm dropping pretty hard. We wanna make sure we control that descent. So an easy fix on this is just letting them know that they need to tighten up and stay straight, okay? All right, another thing we see, um, so someone may set their feet up too far from that anchor point and they're simply just not getting enough out of that row, okay? Uh, so we wanna encourage them to walk their feet in to their, and got a little more angle to it, okay? Uh, if you wanna make it harder, you can have them walk their feet down more. They may have to bend their knees, but um, that will make it more challenging. All right, these are some variations we can throw in. We can do a single leg style, so they gotta balance on one leg while they row. Challenging for the rotation aspect, There we go. Um, one thing I forgot to mention, as far as the standard pull, we want them to pull with a neutral grip. So that could be thumbs up. Um, all right, so right here, I'm going into a single arm row, so both feet on the ground. I'm just grabbing one ring. This is also challenging for that rotation aspect as we pull ourselves up. It's a challenging uh, variation, but on this, if you're watching someone do it, we don't want them to let their shoulders dip too much. Then we may have an exercise where we have them rotate, but uh, if we're doing a standard single on ring row, we want to keep those shoulders square to that anchor point. All right, so these are some variations to the ring row.